Abigail Stallander and I'm a junior art major here at Westmont College. I'll be talking about Christoffel Jaeger's Temptation of Christ. This Temptation of Christ is a woodcut done from one of Ruben's particular paintings that was burned in a fire. Rubens had a lot of painters and woodcutters that worked with him kind of as his student so that he could widely distribute his prints. The thing that I like best about this woodcut is the movement of the cloth. It creates a more dynamic emphasis where you can really see the impact that the devil has as he's tempting Christ. Another interesting thing about woodcuts is that when you're making them, you carve out the areas you want white and leave the areas that you want black, which is reversed from how you usually would draw or paint something when you would put in the darker areas. This creates a really big challenge for the artist because the artist has to think in the opposite direction when carving. It also allows you to create more emphasis, as you can see by the halo surrounding Christ's head. Well, using the dark lines around the head, it allows the viewer to be able to recognize who the important figure is in the piece. Another thing about wood carvings is that they're printed in reverse. So when carving them, this actually would be flipped the other direction. And then when you print it, it's the right way that you want it, which create another challenge when making the piece. Mm -hmm.